Waiting, waiting, waiting for the lights to go to green and then we'll get the flash. But so many cars to get into the straight line. The lights are red and it's a very quick throw to green. Looks like it's a very, very tidy... Oh, great moves coming up the grid. It looks like Sky Tempest to Ferrari's game, but from pole position, the 51 AF Corsa Ferrari's got its nose in front. In second place is the Aston Martin from the outside the front row. The 48 Mercedes diving up the inside. Is that going to take second place? We've got half a dozen cars going straight on down the escape road. The number 46 BMW is going places. I think we lost basically cars six. Sixth through to about ninth going up. We're going to have to have some positions handed back. I was about to say, let's hope we can behave. Bodywork the 48 damaged. Mercedes has got bodywork damage to the left rear. And I think the 48 was one of the bodywork has just flown off the Mercedes, I think. So that is real disaster indeed for the Windward Racing. And what a chaotic start. Even the Audi coming through there as well. So it's been absolutely manic coming through the second chicane. People just driving straight across it. Now, the Porsche was definitely the right thing, but others just drove across. There will be penalties galore. OK, what we've got is Ihan Shinguvin in his Porsche up into second place. And talk about the wounded, the Lion Speed GP car missing quite a lot of front body work. We've got a Ferrari sitting sideways in the track there. Importantly for our race leader, Alessio Rivera, he was clear of the nonsense that happened behind the carambolage, if you will, of Dorian Boccalacci's car in the hands of uh, Ihan Shenguven. That's a Schumacher CLRT Porsche. That has gained many positions to go into second place. Boards being held out. Safety car is coming our way. Well, how did it all go wrong? Great start from the red and yellow Ferrari and a good start from the outside of the front row from the green and yellow Aston Martin, Mattia Drudy. But there was a charge from third on the grid uh, from Lucas Auer. Now, he was actually trying to defend from the Schumacher CLRT Porsche. At this point, it looked safe for the first two cars, but then... Oh, well, well, he now got tagged I can by see. the Porsche, didn't he? Well, tagged by the Porsche. He squeezed across the nose of the 007 Aston Martin, and that was the blow that Sheldon van Linda had his BMW for Team WRT put sideways, nose into barrel, looking from above. Gosh, the only place to be was Alessio Rivera's position, and to have uh, the battle for second place, the challenge for second place, going to, into a game of Skittles. You can see how about 15 cars went wide and down the escape road there. Then they accelerated away with places changing all the time. This is a fantastic view as we look down on it. You can see the movement. We thought the blame was with Lucas Auer, but it does look as though Ihenshin and Guven was the one that, in that yes. black and gold Porsche, I think he hit the pushed back him, of the... and that pushed the number 32 to yes. the WRT BMW. He, he tagged the back of the Mercedes, which then turned it to the left, which then put it into the path of the number seven, Aston Martin. But then the more serious incident occurred coming down into the second chicane. So look, on both, and there you can see what happened. Sheldon van der Linde was on the outside of the Aston Martin. The Mercedes got tagged, pushed in. So let's, there's the Porsche running behind the Mercedes. Watch and see, there's van der Linde to the left alongside. So he goes down the side of the Aston Martin. The Mercedes tags the Aston Martin, which in turn spins around van der Linde. Well, that was captured perfectly by Raffaele Marcello's onboard camera. You can see cars coming back onto the track. Now we're looking, this is the view into the second chicane, riding with Chris Frogat. It's looking tight. Cars bouncing off each other. He gets through, oh, but taking a bit of a shunt from behind. And, uh, well, very, very busy. In fact, I think the number 30 uh, Team BMW car came. Well, let's take a look. This is the this middle all order. happened, Bruce, this all happened behind what we're watching. These cars are peeling through, but behind there was a serious incident occurring, which is just off camera to the left. And there it is.